And right now, new video showing the crash that ended a police chase in Miami this morning. It began in Northwest Miami Dade when police spotted the stolen van. Eventually, the driver going on the wrong side of the road and crashing into an Uber. Several people were hurt in the wreck. Local 10's Ian Margul is live at the scene with the development. See in. Yeah, this ended up a very serious crash. Take a look here behind me. And as you mentioned, three people were eventually taken to the hospital. Police still investigating at this hour. A violent crash in Miami Thursday morning after a van refused to stop for cops in Northwest Miami-Dade. Miami-Dade police tell us crime prevention units were working undercover near Northwest 42nd Avenue and Flagler Street, an area they say is known for drug activity. They observed a white van that was parked, um, caught their attention. Once they did a routine records check of that van, they were able to confirm that the van was reported stolen. Officers began following the van north to 7th Avenue before turning on their lights to try and make a traffic stop, but the driver of the van just kept going. Officers backed off as a helicopter began following the stolen van, and it made a turn to go back southbound into the city of Miami on Northwest 27th Avenue going toward Flagler Street. There was one point that in this particular case, it's a female driver. The subject is a female. Went north, southbound on the northbound lanes. Went against traffic, and that's when it unfortunately struck a white vehicle. And so back out live here in Miami, we can tell you that once it hit that car, two people inside the car, it was an Uber, a, a male driver and a female passenger, they were both taken to the hospital. The male driver in stable condition, the female driver with serious injuries, they said multiple fractures. And the woman who was driving that van was actually pinned between the dashboard of the van and the wall of the building that van then crashed into. It took about 10 minutes for Cruz to extricate her. She was then brought to the hospital. She is in critical condition, we are told. And police say when they eventually went through this scene, they actually found narcotics paraphernalia inside that van. And as Miami Day detectives were speaking with City of Miami detectives, City of Miami detectives told them they have been looking for a van that is very similar to this one with a female driver that is connected to several burglaries in this area. So they are now checking to see if that is connected as well. So again, three people taken to the hospital after this very serious crash. Live in Miami, I'm Ian Margul, Local 10 News.